have spoken. The Bible, the complete word of God abridged, is in the style of Monty Python's Life of Brian. It is juvenile, but not blasphemous. Jesus, Jesus, both his left and Irish man. Supreme Court. Can I get an amen for the way of the Lord? Amen! Better than the book. Minister from the Church of Scotland who told us that in person one time. We have ministers of all denominations, fives, tens, and twenties, come see it, and they send their congregation. All right, listen up, children of Israel. I got some good news and some bad news. <laughs> the good news is I got them down to ten. It's wacky, it's zany, and a little profaney. Sister Marianne Walsh, Arlington Catholic Herald. Wait a second, computers were on Noah's Ark. No, silly computers were in the Garden of Eden. Matt, we covered this. Eve had an apple, right? <laughs> Eve had an apple and Adam had a wang. You remember this? Story. Every night we quiz the audience, you know. Has anyone here tonight read the Bible cover to cover? And in an audience of 800, there's like six people who've read it cover to cover. So it's more or less as a public service. The reduced Shakespeare Company's The Bible, The Complete Word of God, abridged. Old Testament first act, New Testament second act. In Israel, it's just a one act. I would now like to read the 20th section of the book of Job. <laughs> We think that God has a wonderful sense of humor because, of course, he made people with a sense of humor. Critics have called the Bible a revelation, uproarious and funny as hell. Amazing special effects, partial nudity, sex and violence, and that's just the Old Testament. Don't miss this affectionate, irreverent retelling of the ultimate bestseller. From fig leaves to final judgment, the Reduced Shakespeare Company puts the fun into fundamentalism. Get your tickets now. You'll laugh. You'll cry. You'll kiss good money goodbye. The bad news is adultery is still one of them. So. <laughs>